I want that bitch off my throne. We hit Maria's rum factory. We fucked up her billboards, and the bitch didn't even bat a fake eyelash. Meanwhile, Maximus Matanzas is dead, and I'm still stuck in this swamp. We've spilled real blood, Danny, and Marquesa doesn't even have a scratch on her. Fuck this. I'm gonna call out her bullshit right to her face. Marquesa's putting on a PR event, some kind of tour for foreign journalists. If you can get us passes, I'll give her a one-on-one -on -one performance in front of the whole world. Force them to hear the truth. Let's fuck up Marquesa's show. Need a ride. Hey, hey. Tell me what you know. You been to the Pez Volador Diving Club? Muy hey, thanks. Hmm? you there, Oluso? Clara, I need press passes. I'm coming up to Maria's TV station. Anything you can tell me? Press passes? I won't ask. Look, Danny, they're holding one of our guerrillas inside. So free them if you can. I'll do my best, Gracias, Clara. Our honorable minister of culture. Minister Marquesa makes it easy for us to tell the art that's good for us from the art that's bad for us. All you have to do is ask yourself, has this been approved by Minister Marquesa? If it hasn't, it is your duty to turn it over to the good people of the Protectores de la Patria. It's cool to be young, but Go it's even them. cooler to be loyal. Come back. What was that?
Engineer spotted. What does this unlock? Passes. Let's do this shit. Hola, reporter Benevides. Trespasses. This is my son, Danny. Put a shit on song for that bitch. So don't fuck this up. Easy, Talia. Keep it together, okay? You keep it together, Danny. Don't lose those passes. Meet me and Bicho in the botanical gardens parking lot and don't go in without us. <laughs> Let's go, girl! Get that cat away from me! Here, you're a reporter now. Felicidades. Fuck yeah. This is Talia Benavides from Urban Garden. Coño, it's good enough. Take our stuff so we don't get shot. Let's change these clothes. Wait, aren't you? Silvia Balboa Garden City. Urban Garden. Can we move this along? Maria's waiting. Welcome, welcome, my beautiful foreign friend. Gracias for traveling so far to learn about Viviro, the Castillo administration's pride and joy. Let us begin. The architecture. Impressive. <whistles> nice. Lot of money not going to the rest of Yara. Today, 
I am honored and excited to share with you the miracle of Viviro, a revolutionary cancer treatment. Thirteen years ago, the brilliant biochemist Dr. Edgar Reyes discovered a compound unique to Yara that slows cancer cell growth. But it is Presidente Anton Castillo's full support that allows us to produce this all-natural drug. Come, witness a breakthrough of innovation, generosity, and true Yaren spirit. Follow me. Спасибо for the inside tour. You really make a reporter feel special. Anything for you, Nikolai. <laughs> It all starts with Nicotiana Yarana, our native tobacco plant grown in our western farmlands. Our tobacco is world famous for its unique flavor. Wondering what made it so unique, Dr. Reyes studied the plant's properties. And I don't mean he smoked a lot of cigars. <laughs> he found a compound that actually slows cancer cell division, practically to a halt. This way, my lovely people. Ready for the next part of our Vivino adventure? Dr. Reyes found that natural tobacco crops produced a limited amount of the compound. So, President Anton commissioned Yara's best minds to work with Dr. Reyes to design an all-natural fertilizer, PG-240. Spread on, like a hairspray, it uses gene therapy and nutrients to boost production of the compound. If you look, this tobacco has large red leaves. This is from the fertilizer. Beautiful, no? Puro, organico, e exotico. No? Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. It is so much fun. Sounds like a film. Excellent, a volunteer. The fertilizer is working on the plants as we speak. This is the beginning of the Viviro process. Using McKay to sidestep embargoes was considered quite controversial. Those critics only want to profit from cancer, from death. They see us as a threat, so they try to ruin us. This way, por favor. Okay, closer, closer. Get intimate. <laughs> I want you to hear me. In Central Yara, our finest scientists extract, refine, and package the cancer-fighting tobacco compound called Yarantin. Found only in Yaran tobacco, Dr. Reyes thinks Yarantin is why our cigars are so smooth. <laughs> Delicious and beneficial, no? I smoke one cigar a week and it keeps me skinny and strong. It's true. <laughs> okay, that's the tour. Our interactive stations are now available for you to enjoy. When you are ready, join me by the gate in the outdoor lounge for a surprise guest. There are rumors that farmers exposed to PG-240 are actually developing cancer from it. Rumors spread by fools and believed by idiots. It's not true. Uh-huh. Right. I didn't think this could happen. I hear even more now than before.
when you said one-on-one -on -one performance, what did you mean? My fucking solo career? I don't know. Does it matter? Maria just needs to know, needs to hear, needs to feel the pain she deserves. Not sure she can even feel at all. I'd love to know if she was really Castillo's mistress. But she'd probably try to disappear me for asking. Yaren to Yaren? You believe that organic shit? You're Yaren. She said I was writing an exclusive. Uh, Yaren at heart only. And this ends our tour. But before we go, a surprise. Meet Dr. Edgar Reyes, the pioneer behind Viviro. Dr. Reyes, thank you so much for making an appearance. Ah, muy bien. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the showroom and some of our finest Yaren Rom. This is a preview of other Viviro products we are developing. Chewables, nasal sprays, vaginal suppositories. It is a, uh, I say, sneak peek. <laughs> so peek, peek away. <laughs> if you have questions, please email my assistant, Julio. Come now, Dr. Reyes, we don't want to be late. Neither do we, let's get in there. I told Bicho to leave our weapons back here. I hope you're ready to fuck shit up. So, what now? Take it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes. Take it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes. Yeah. Okay. 
Special program for you today. Maria Puta Marquesa, Minister of Culture, Uncle Anton's personal whore. You're also director to the True Yarn Academy, no? Where you fry people's brains to make sure they play nice? Like you did to me, right, Maria? What? Mm, don't play dumb, bitch! Talia, put the gun down. She's not worth it. You... You attacked my home. You put your filth on my network. You have any idea the embarrassment I had to endure because of your disgusting performance? I have given everything I am to be here. You think you can take that away from me? My academy was built to save fake yarns like you and that muddy macho you spread your perversions with. Where is she? Does she not approve of you playing with guns? Fuck. Come on, let's go! Let's go! What happened? Get her the fuck out of here!
Bicho, you're not having a heart attack. Uh, how do you know? We need Paolo. Paolo knows how to fix this. Paolo's in Miami by now. No, 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 he's still here. Danny, come find me in the little mountain just west of the airport. There's a bunker, and I'll be the Mexican on top of it. Okay, okay, just take a breath. I'm on my way. Clara, Maria Marquesa is dead. Yeah, it's on the news everywhere. What happened? Wasn't the plan. Fuck, I don't think there ever was a plan. Look, you and Dali are at the top of Anton's shit list. Watch your back. A lot of people are counting on you, Danny. We got a chance here. Word is Castillo has a defection problem. Who knows? He might even surrender. You are dreaming, Clara. Fuck yeah, I am. <clears throat> Charon! Bad bird. Come here, come here, come here! I thought Radio Libertad would fix everything, but everything's fucked. Talia's doing some crazy shit. I haven't slept in days. I, nothing's been right since Paolo left. My dealer swears he saw Paolo at the airport, and he was with that fucker, Bembe. Danny, you can't let Paolo leave. He's the only thing that can put Talia back from the cliff, Carnala. I even tried to get Palo, got as far as the airport gate, and then boom, soldiers everywhere. I squirted a little and I ran. You know I'm no good with soldiers, Danny. You got to get Palo back. You got to make everything okay again. Hmm. You might want to do this on the download, Danny. There's a lot of soldiers down there. Paolo, what did you get yourself into? While her murderers are free, I will not rest. My soldiers will not rest. All of Yara will not rest. Special forces. Have been brought to justice. The executions of Clara Garcia, of Maximus Matanzas, of all the Libertad terroristas will be televised. Their lies will be met with the true justice of Yara Law and Order.
bloody Paolo. I think you're here to see your dear friend Bembe. But we both know you're after Paolo. Where is he? He's supposed to be on a first class flight to Miami right now. But you sold him out. No, no, no. This was one of life's rare surprises. Soldados were waiting for me, Rojas. So I struck a deal. So that's when you sold him out? I traded for my freedom and kickbacks. But I'm not heartless. I will tell you where they took him. Paolo's in a resort in Barrial. If they've done anything to him, I'm coming for you. Promises, promises. If I were you, I'd hurry on. <laughs> Paolo, what did you get yourself into? An 
Officer. 